Hello friends, welcome to the channel Solution. Today, in this video, we will tell you about the Selivanov's test. Means, what is Selivanov's test? And also, demonstrate you how this test is performed through the animation, along with its principle. Selivanov's test is the specific identification test for keto sugar. We will explain it in more detail at the end of this video. So, now, let's know how Selivanov's test is performed. First of all, take a test tube and then add 2 ml of Selivanov's reagent. And how this reagent is prepared? The practical video of the preparation of Selivanov reagent is already uploaded in our channel. Link of that video is given in the description box. After adding 2 ml of Selivanov's reagent in the test tube, then add 2 ml of test solution in the same test tube. Test solution means the solution in which we have to detect the presence of keto sugar. Means to detect whether keto sugar is present or not in it. After adding 1 ml of test solution, then mix the content of the test tube and then boil the content of test tube in the water bath for 2 minutes. And then observe any color changes in the test tube. If we observe red color solution, means if the content of the test tube changes to red color it means in this test solution keto sugar is present here you can see that deep red color form due to the presence of keto sugar in our sample example of keto sugar is fructose sucrose etc means if in any sample fructose or sucrose is present then we can identify it by Selivanov's test means in our sample keto sugar is present then it will show positive result and if allo sugar is present then Selivanov's test show negative results means no color changes takes place means no red color formation within two minutes because Selivanov test is the specific color identification test, color reaction test for ketosis. So, what is the principle of this test? Selivanov's reagent is the mixture of resorcinol and concentrated H2SO4, means concentrated sulfuric acid. And if in our test solution, keto sugar is present, then when we add Selivanov reagent, then the concentrated sulfuric acid which is present in the reagent dehydrate the keto sugar and after the dehydration of keto sugar by sulfuric acid it convert into furfural derivative within few minutes as compared to the aldosis and then this furfural derivative condense with the resorcinol which is present in the reagent to form red color complex within two minutes due to this deep red color solution observed in the test tube. But the aldohexosis react very slowly with the resorcinol to form the same red color complex. And this is how we can distinguish aldo sugar and keto sugar. What is aldo sugar? Aldo sugar is the sugar in which functional group present is aldehyde. And then what is keto sugar? Keto sugar is the type of carbohydrate in which the functional group is ketone. That's why it is called ketose. Means by this test we can differentiate fructose and glucose. Fructose is ketose. Functional group ketone is present and glucose is aldose. Means in the glucose aldehyde functional group is present. And fructose shows Selivanov test positive and glucose shows negative result with the Selivanov test. So this is all about the Selivanov test. Thank you very much for watching this video.